Hi, my name is Kiki, and today we're going to be doing cat face painting. So this is going to be a pink and white kitty. And I'm going to start with two ears, just like that, and a little bit of hair. And then I'm going to bring the white down. I'm not going to actually do the tip of her nose. I'm going to go around the tip of her nose. And I'm going to make the whisker area. And I'm also going to make the outside of the whisker area look like whiskers. So I just kind of flick my brush out like that. Looks so cute. Just going to make sure I get both sides even kind of fill this into and you're going to leave an area underneath the ears and that is going to be a different color. Okay, and just sort of touch that up a little bit. And just touch it up. Make sure it's colored in. And do her nostrils. And that's our first step. So for the second step, we're going to color in the nose and the ears. So I'm going to use a pink paint. And I'm going to do somewhat of a triangle shape, just like a real kitty would have. You can kind of go down, sort of shape it around the nostrils a little bit. I like to make it go out a little bit too, like a triangle. And I'm using a medium brush for this. And then I'm going to go up here, do the inside of the ears. And I'm also going to do her eyelids as well. So close your eyes for me, kitty cat. Make sure it's not too wet. You want it to be just a little bit wet. And keep your eyes closed. Just go over the eyes. So it looks like the eyes are part of the ear and it gives a nice effect that way. And then I'm gonna do the other side this way. Looks really cute. This is a really popular face. I would say this is one of the most popular faces is the kitty cat. So this is a good face to learn how to do. Great. And that is our second step. Okay, so for our third step, we're going to use black, and we're also going to use a very fine brush. So the th first thing I'm going to do is the whisker area, and I'm going to take a straight line right from the middle of the nose, and I'm going to go down. You can fill it in a little bit like that, so it looks like kitty mouth. I'm going to go one, two, three, and one, two, three. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to outline the top. So I like to just make some little black lines up there just to kind of define it. And then what I like to do is I like to outline the top. So stay really still. I'm gonna outline the top. And then I'm gonna outline this side. And this side. Great. And also, you can outline right here too, if you want. Gives it a nice definition. Mm -hmm. 
And then I'm gonna do a little bit of outlining around the whiskers. So you can just sort of do it randomly, however you want, but just so it sort of defines the whiskers. And I'm gonna do the same thing on this side. That looks really cute. And the last thing I'm gonna outline is the nose. I'm just gonna make a couple lines there and there. And that is our third step. For the finishing touches, we're gonna do highlighting and sparkling. So I like to do the highlights right before the sparkles. And for highlighting, you can just sort of uh, take a white, take the white uh, paint and do a little bit on the nose. You can do a little bit up there if you want, just to sort of make certain areas stand out. And then for sparkles, for her I'm gonna use some white sparkles. And I'm gonna put them on her nose, like that. And I think I'll put a little bit of sparkles on her eyes too, so close your eyes. Actually, in the ear area, not on the eyes. But that looks really cute. And you can also put sparkles all over too, if you want. You could put sparkles on the bridge of the nose and on the whiskers, just a little bit. And the sparkles will stay on as long as the paint is semi-wet. Once the paint is really dry, the sparkles won't stay on. So it's good to get it while the paint's wet. And there you go, that is your simple, cute kitty cat. Mm -hmm.